Hello everyone, welcome back for the extended play attempt to get 100% in Baddest of the Bands. So, the main thing we're going to spend our time on is this fun machine, but that's going to take a little bit because I'm not particularly good at this game. So let's take care of the rest of the stuff we have to get. Notice we still have a manual page. We need one more collectible, which would be that manual page there. We need three more musical moments, one more expression of affection, and a, about 45,000 points in Hot Babelian Odyssey. So let's go take care of all the other stuff first, because it will be fast to get through. Okay, let's see... We need to go to Strong Badia. Yeah, where is he? There he is. You know, the concert's over. You don't have to wear that jacket anymore. Well, since there's already so much positive buzz about them, I decided I would just go ahead and start a band called Security myself. Listen to my first hit single. Security left. Security left. Yeah, that's enough of that. Indeed. That is enough of that. Of that. And you noticed we were a three-necked axeman. We're now a Nordic percussion lord. Yeah. So anyway, let's keep going, shall we? Just about everything else is found at Club Techno Chocolate. And it's all going to be found at the turntable. Yeah. This is literally stuff you could not do during the course of the main game because you didn't have the right items whenever you could visit here. So let's start with doing the wiggly on the turntable. Wiggle wag, wiggle wag, wiggle wag, go! Sweet holy mother of moly! It's the back cover of the limousine game! Complete with an autographed photo of the real-life Babelian who was the model for the in-game Babelian. Yeah, that was totally necessary. But so is playing it again. My face! My face! Please open the needles in my face! My face! My face! Please open the needles in my face! And then... You got to slide to the right, y'all, bridesmaids! So let's see here. Oh, I did not want the inventory. I'm glad they changed the name to Club Techno. Yeah, we heard that before. And now we just need one expression of affection. So yeah, we have everything done except for that. And here. Could just let that up because I need to go to the track for the final expression of affection. Let's see here, uh, Coach Z, good teeth, lady something, roast beef. Mm hmm. Tired of trying to make things work as the 101? Ah, uh, Bubs will be back. He loves me like a brother. You shut your face! Hates me like a brother, too! And there we have that. Bubs loves him like a brother, and that is our, uh, coolness. Yeah. Let's rock out one more time. Well, all right! Uh... He agreed with me. So now all we should have left to do is the hot Babelian Odyssey. Which I am terrible at. I will still show off the game at least once, just because... And then I will show off my run that gets 45,000 points. And I will use the first level as the uh, explanation of how you get points in this game. But it kind of plays like right, Defender. Fun machine. Give me some of that but sweet, long-delayed video game funk. Or metal, as the case may be. Did you miss me? 
So you've got Hot Babely and Odyssey. Yes, indeed, complete with the Hot Babely in there. Yeah. So anyway. We control the little thing on the left that looks like the tour bus. Whoa, it can I fire off shots that take out aliens. Has a tractor beam, which sucks up the uh, hot Bablians. And I'm not going to do that for a little bit. I need one to be start getting captured here, so I can show that off. Come on, four more, more aliens. See, they the aliens try to capture them. Step you suck them the up. Bus, you get ladies. 100. 100 times level number per alien saved, and 10 times level number per alien shot. So in other words, I'm getting 20 points per alien kill, and 200 points per alien save here. If they manage to steal one... You lose some points. Those flying bees are everywhere, man! Strongbat is the master of yeah, Babelian Rescue That's how already. you play this game. You also have a smart bomb, which clears everything on screen. You only get two of those per life. So you, you essentially have six smart bombs available to you throughout the game. But if you can stay low, that's a good thing. Because it reduces the time you spend stuck in place. And there's the other new enemy we meet. That's pretty much it. Those little flying V guitars are obstacles. You hit them, you explode. If an alien hits you, you explode. If a missile hits you, you explode. But other than that, this is not that hard of a game. This really isn't that hard of a game, but it's hard to get far in it. Because it does get... It actually does start to get rather hectic. Smart bomb to destroy all those. So I don't think the I could have navigated that V. You. This is a bus, after all. It does not handle that well. And I'm going to lose some points there. In space, no one can hear you. Squeeze! not doing too bad. with the tractor beam is when you're actually firing it, you're kind oh, of... Man. Ah, I got hit there, finally. Okay, I'm still in good shape. 9 out of 20, 21,000 points on the first death. Those flying bees are everywhere, man! The power of rock compels you! And got hit again. There goes round number two. So I got one more life to get to 17,000. Eat hot metal death, Nebulon! Strongman is the master of Babely and Rescue! That's about to move right into a missile, too. I forgot to use my smart bombs on my second life. 
That's not a good sign for me making it through the rest of these. No! Nope. And there well, we have that it. That was embarrassing. Yes, it was. So I will likely be right back because I need to change one setting here. Crap! Ah. You've won this battle, droopy hoarding alien scum, but the war will be limousines! The power of rock compels you! Ah, could not do it. If only okay. I could have saved a few more hot baby droopies! Shut up. Strongman is the master of wow, baby I'm close. rescuery! I'm really close. Probably just shoot down aliens to finish out this one, too. Crap. Or miss aliens no. entirely and not Rats. make it. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure it's 45,000. Maybe not. Maybe it was only 40,000. Did I make it? No, I did not. But I am a spiky rock deity, but that's still not top level there. Alright, fun machine. Give me some of that sweet, long delayed One video more try. game funk. Or metal, as the case may be. Well, many Fable more tries, but I am going to save your awaits. If I just had. Well, if I hadn't screwed up at the very end there, the last run, I would have made it. Darn it. That's not what limousine can do for hot baby let's and hopefully, groupies. Let's hope I remember to use my smart bombs this time instead of, you know, letting them waste as I watch as something comes up from below or above. Because a wasted smart bomb is better than a wasted vehicle. You. Keep your slimy alien paws off my baby and groupies. Apparently there's some very durable uh, the bus, people we're saving. Ladies. They fall from a pretty good height. Then again, it could just be a little gravity. Those flying V's are everywhere, man! Whoa, I think that one winked at me. Not the best use, but I was about to die. In space, no one can hear you. Squeal! Don't like using a smart bomb on level 3, but I went down the wrong path there, so... Didn't have much choice. The power of rock compels you! You know, he didn't have to show Mars of the uh, Teen Girl Squad comic in this one. He could just show Mars of Pan this game for the exploitation of women, bit. Whoa, I think that one winked at me. That was dangerous. That was even worse for me, I think. At least I used both smart bombs this time. And I've still got all my lives. That's not what limousine can do for all my lives. Groupies. One set of smart bombs gone, but 20,000 points. That's all I need at this point. Come on. Thing. 
Step onto the bus, ladies. Okay, I think I've got this. I think I've got it this time. Ouch! Did not have it. But no smart bombs to d to avoid that, so oh well. Yeah, got it. How far can I make it? In space, no one can hear you. 59,000 points so far. That's a pretty good run, isn't it? Those flying bees are everywhere, man! Oops. And got smacked by a missile. And smacked by another missile. You know, this game is actually pretty hard. Yes, it is. But we are done with it. So. Quit out. And get our final costume piece. The limousine t-shirt. We are now the impossibly rocked out at 100%. So, one thing before we leave, since I haven't shown this off at any other point in time. The full set of uh, costume items for this episode. Here we go, this way. Headband. Looking good. The limousine t-shirt. I'm charming! The leopard print pants. The boots. I don't recall. Nope, no accessory this time. That's just all we get, isn't it? Can't be all we get. We got five. We got four things. Now I can't remember what the other one was. Oh, well. Hmm. You know, I know we got one other piece of clothing. I just can't remember what it was now. You get a mustache. Because mustache. Oh yeah, it was that sloshy shirt. Now check it out, guys. He's limousine, but in space. Yeah, that that was terrible. I know. I'll oh. Stop that. Now. <laughs> so anyway. Now that we have completed 100% episode 3, it's time for me to refresh my memory on episode 4. So, I will see you guys next time for more Let's Play Strong Bad's Cool Game.
but you Soak know. Soak it in, ladies. Like that. So take care, folks. See you later. I said see you later. <laughs>